here we are at the entrance of 800 Grand Concourse, apartment LHS. This is the extremely large living room, which has very high beam ceilings, as you can see, and is constructed of solid concrete. So you have parquet floors over concrete, and also concrete block walls, and a concrete ceiling. Um, I'll turn around. This is the entryway. They actually have a full-size sofa in here, some bookcases, and by the door, there are two huge closets. I'll show you now. There's one. It's quite deep. And another one over here, more of a utility closet. It goes back quite far. All right. We go into the living room. We are facing south here, and because we are on the lobby level, you might think this is the ground floor, but actually we're on the level of the second floor. We are facing the side between this building and the lot next door, but I wanna show you definitely what the view is. So you can see when you look down that we are definitely on the second floor level. This is the locked side alleyway uh, of this building. Then you see the roofs of the buildings, um, the low buildings that are uh, facing the street in the back. That's Concourse Village West. Over there you see a new building on Concourse Village West going up. And you'll see that even if there is construction here, they definitely would need to leave a space. Um, and we're right at the part where they would need to leave that space. Um, there's a 30 foot setback requirement and so you would still get plenty of light and sun. We are facing south and you can see you do get quite a lot of light. This is the, these are the buildings along Grand Concourse. All right, now we're turning in this that you see off to the side, currently used as a dining room. It is legally a second bedroom. So this is a legal junior for the convertible bedroom. It has a closet already, and it would be very easy to put a wall with a door here if you want. And I'm just gonna pan back so you can see the living room from this side. You can see how spacious it is. They have a full-size sofa up in the entryway, chairs, a very large sectional, and then by the window, yet another seating area here with a chair and a table. So you have a lot of space and unusually high ceilings, which only exist in this building on the lobby level. So it is an extra bonus for being on this floor. All right, we're going into the dining area slash second bedroom. You can see out, um, you have a view there. You have light here. That is uh, your next door neighbor over there. Um, here you have the doorway into the kitchen. If you turn this into a bedroom, you could close up this doorway if you would like. And you have the kitchen area here, which does have a window and plenty of space. This kitchen has not been renovated. Um, the floor was redone many years ago, but you have a lot of options for redoing it if you like. These are the original cabinets from the 1950s. So you can uh, replace them with whatever you like. Now, we're walking through the kitchen. Here on our left is the bathroom. It also has a window. Um, and uh, the tile work on the walls is original, but it's in very good condition. I'm gonna turn on the light. Um, so you can see there's a light up there. The floor was redone at some point many years ago. That is the original tub. Um, the sink and the toilet are in good condition. The owners have owned this for a few years and uh, they moved in thinking they would renovate, but they actually never did. So things have not been changed. The floors are the parquet all the way through. Here next to the bathroom, you see the bedroom, which is also quite large. They have a large bed over here. Then there's a whole separate dressing area room where they have uh, two dressers. Master bedroom has a large closet here. So you can see it's quite large and quite deep. And over there, a big 
double window facing south. Again, looks out um, at the same alleyway that we looked at from the living room. Um, so you have quite a lot of light and open views. This is the fire escape. Most people in the building have removed the uh, grates since this is quite a safe neighborhood um, considered to be. So most people have taken those away. Those are still here. So from the kitchen, we have a little hallway again that goes back to the entry foyer. There's an additional closet here, which is an also very deep utility closet. So you have five very nice large closets. This beautiful entryway, as I said before, there's a full size sofa here, lovely parquet floors, very high beamed ceilings, it's ultra, ultra, ultra quiet and sunny. All right, that's the end of our tour. Thank you.